Okay, hi, good afternoon. How many of you are Fractal users? One. Okay, uh, uh, I'm going to talk through uh, some of the changes that we've made to the Fractal platform over the last year, uh, maybe show you a few things that you didn't know existed, uh, and then uh, talk to you a little bit about what we're doing in 2013. Uh, and then we know that over the last few years, uh, you've been asking us about can we get Fractal to work on an iPad? Uh, and I'm going to show you the front of works on an iPad. Uh, I'm just going to show you a few things to do with that as well right at the end. So uh, what happened in 2012? Well, you'll know that in 2011 we made significant changes to the interface uh, and gave that whole uh, complete kind of new look of paint. Uh, and then in 2012 we've uh, introduced tabbed browsing so that your rooms are open as tabs. I'll show you that in a moment. Uh, we've made some changes to the test tool so that that looks uh, more modern and is easier for teachers to create tests. Uh, and we've also improved the workflow and everything that we're doing in development for Frontier at the moment is about improving the workflow and reducing the number of clicks that you need to get to do those everyday tasks within the environment. 